everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Crystal Chanel, and today we are going to be playing around with the new Dyson Airwrap. This is going to be the newer version that Dyson released that does not make you actually change the plates or the attachments out. So we're gonna see how this works. It'll be my first time actually using it on a full head. I've already used it to actually just blow dry my hair and I'll insert some footage up here so that you can see that process. But what we're going to go ahead and do is just kind of start playing with some of the attachments and see what gives us a better blowout look. Uh, I will be wrapping my hair afterwards uh, just to hold the style for the week because I do plan, I do not plan on using this air wrap every day. That's, that'll just be too much heat. So let's just go ahead and start playing around with it and see what attachments we like. All right, so if you are not familiar with the Dyson Air Wrap, this is what it looks like. This is the newest version. And as you see, this is your power button. This is also your cool shot button. And then you have the ability to change the heat setting. I have mine on high, as well as the airflow setting. I also have that on high. But with your attachments, you can always release them and take them off just by sliding this down. And then when you get ready to put it on, you just tap it back in. So. And as you can see on this brush right here, it does move. I thought that was pretty cool. So I'm just gonna go ahead and section off my hair. I'm gonna take this off because I won't be using this. I am going to section off my hair and I'm thinking about going in with the brush just a little bit on my ends. All right, let's section off my hair and and the only reason why I'm going in with that brush on my ends is because my ends are still a bit damaged and they're not as smooth as I would like for them to be. So I'm using that brush just to kind of smooth them out some. just a little bit nothing drastic but you can tell the difference this off and we are going to jump right into using this medium size one that comes with the air wrap this is the bigger one out of the two and I'm just gonna pop this in here and I think that I want it to go in this direction so I'm going to just move this to be right there because you can interchange this to whichever direction you want the airflow to go. So I'm gonna move it over here. I am going to pin curl each one of my curls as I go through and do it. And I am going to <clears throat> just spritz my hair just a little bit on the ends because this particular tool works better on dampened hair. So I'm not going to like completely wet it at all. 
I'm just going to spritz it so that the air wrap will have something to hold on to. All right, so let's hope. I'm grabbing my hair in the middle like this. I'm gonna cut this on. You're gonna see me go ahead and switch the direction right here. Grab it in the middle. And you see how that just wraps around.
front of my hair and see exactly how I want to style this. So I'm thinking Switch the barrels back. taking out 
these bobby pins and the pin curls and see exactly what it looks like. <clears throat> so as I mentioned to y'all earlier, this is my first time using the Dyson Airwrap. So we'll see how it comes out. <laughs> we'll see it together. But um, there is a little bit of a learning curve, not much. I think that once you watch enough YouTube videos and you practice and do it yourself, by the time you get like on the third or the fourth uh, section of hair, you know how to do it. Um, and you start figuring out little bits and pieces that make it easier for you and your, your actual hair type. So um, definitely a very small learning curve, but overall, super easy to use. I'm hoping this gives me a lot of volume. All right, so here's everything taken down without me combing it. So I'm just gonna finger comb and see how this comes out. It's definitely giving volume, <laughs> that's for sure. And it's definitely giving um, blowout. Yes. So pretty. Very pretty. Now I have some flyaways and there is supposed to be this flyaway tool. Let's see if it actually works. Uh, okay. But you can't see them over here anymore. Wait a minute, y'all. Flyaways are actually gone. I have a few up here, but I had a lot of them and they're gone. Okay, so I'm going to take a small amount of this, very tiny. I start at the ends and then I go up. Okay, so I absolutely love this. What do y'all think? I think it, it gave me a very airy and um, like a, like it's a, it's a blowout. What do you think? How did it turn out to you? Uh, this took me maybe about 20 minutes to curl it, and this was my first time curling it, so I imagine that 
once I start using this a little bit more, it'll um, go by faster for me. But my hair has so much movement and so much body um, and it came out just gorgeous. Gosh, the body is insane. I love this. What do y'all think? Comment below. Thank you for watching with me on my first time using the Dyson Airwrap. Make sure that you comment below, subscribe to my channel, and like this video. I am in love with all of this volume, y'all. Gosh. All right. I'll see y'all later. Bye.